Brookwood. Hello. How's everybody doing? Doing good? I'm glad you're doing good. It's good to hear that, even though I can't hear it. But I, I am going to guess and I'm going to trust that you are doing good. And we are going to... I don't know when this is going to end, but these pens need to get out of here. Get out of there. All right. Well, let's move on. Let's move on. I don't know what's going on. These pens keep showing up. But today, we're going to do interdependence as our core value. Because interdependence means relying on each other. And that is so important at Brookwood. And our devotional thought of the week is this. Hope in God gives us strength. Hope in God gives us strength. So the sign we're going to do for hope is you're going to make a fist and put it on your chest. And you're going to look up. Okay, that's it. So that's hope. Then we're going to point up. And then we're going to flex our muscles. All right. That's it. So together with the thought of the movement, and go like this. Hope in God gives us strength. Good job, all right? Let's try it again. This time you can repeat the words after me. You can do the movements. Here we go. Hope in God gives us strength love it Isaiah 40 30 to 31 says even youths grow tired and weary and young men stumble and fall but those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength they will soar on wings like eagles they will run and not grow weary, they will walk and not be faint. That's the scripture that is in our chapel on the wall of the chapel foyer. So next time you're in the chapel, you can look for that. But how I would put it today is hope in God gives us strength. All right, good job, everybody. Let's pray. Lord, we put our hope in you, and we ask that you would give us strength. We do not place our hope in anybody else or anything else but you. So give us power today, Holy Spirit, to do your will, and just give us a wonderful day in you. And all God's people said, Amen. Y'all, you have a great day. I will see you later. God bless.